Welcome back to the show. All right, 1999 Tops Finest. Uh, so you can look for these randomly inserted cards. Get a refractor, that would be cool. Uh, all new inserts are prominent figures, Team Finest, Future Finest, blah, blah, blah. Edrin James, pretty cool. So I ended up buying this because I really, I think, and I hope I'm right, I think that there's a um, uh, Kurt Warner rookie card in here. So instead of just buying the card like a normal human should, <laughs> I, I, I find more fun opening a box and then, um, you know, hopefully pulling, excuse me, hopefully pulling one. So that's kind of what I'm going for here. Maybe pull a Kurt Warner rookie card would be really nice. All right. I don't open a lot of football um, in general just because I don't really, I guess I don't collect football that much. I'll buy some older things here and there, but for the most part, I don't buy a heck of a lot of football. Um, so I only have a handful of boxes laying around that I have to get to. Sorry, let me just, uh, customary checklist. Oh, you know what? Let's see. I'll go ahead and show you some of the names. So this is 99. I think Peyton Manning was 98 for his rookie. Uh, here's some rookies here. I guess those are going to be the rookies. Oh my gosh, that is hard to read. Oh, Dante Culpepper. That's a good one. Edron James. Okay, this looks like the draft class. Ricky Williams. Um, Tory Holt. Donovan McNabb. Damn. Um, all right, well, I don't see Kurt Warner's name unless you guys are seeing it, and I'm not. Oh, man. Well, that was, uh, shit. That sucks. Okay, well, there you go. That's, uh, unless I missed it, we're just going to go ahead and open the box anyway, see what we come up with. There's the box. Okay, don't move. And then here's the packs. I really thought Kurt Warner was in here. I ended up buying two boxes. Well, that's a good start. Ricky Williams rookie card. In 1999, I would have been thrilled to have that. Here we go. Um, this is John Randall. Mike Allstott. Very nice. Derek Thomas. Really cool. Um, you know, we're going to show off this rookie of Ricky Williams there. Because that's a... Yeah, not bad. He had a decent career. Um... Oh, wow. Barry Sanders. That is cool. Um, who's this guy? Ty Detmer. I think he was a Heisman Trophy winner. There's a nice back of the old Barry Sanders. 5'9". I think they're being generous. I think he's like 5'7", five, 5'8". Five, Best running back. He was, one, he was my favorite of all time. Or I guess of my generation. Because I never watched... I, I watched very little Walter Payton. Never got to see um, Jim Brown or Gale Sayers or any of that. So, you know, growing up, he was my favorite running back, uh, Barry Sanders, which made me dislike Emmett Smith because I always felt that they were competing. So, you know, had to pull for Barry Sanders, Drew Bledsoe, uh, 99. So no Brady in this one. Uh, John Kitna, uh, Jake Reed and Thunder Dan Marino. I don't know if it's Thunder Dan. That's Dan Marley. That's pretty cool. Dan Marino. Hall of Famer. Alrighty. Another Mike Allstott. Uh, Antonio Freeman. Frank Sanders. The Bus. Jerome Bettis. Ty Detmer. He had a brother, Coy Detmer, I believe. Play. This is a rookie of Michael Cloud. You know what? I feel like this one is a little bit shinier. The bus. So let's just give a quick gander. See if there's anything that says um, refractor on there. I don't. I don't. You know. I don't even know how it would say it. Remember, one set would just have an R on there. All right. Well, I mean, it kind of. Ah, fudge. I don't know, man. I can't tell. <laughs> Alrighty. Might as well check the odds since we're talking about things. Refractors are 1 in 12, so we will see uh, a refractor within these packs here. 
so at least we can kind of have a general idea of what it looks like so if you guys ever buy any 99 jerry rice very nice dark thomas if you ever buy any 99 you'll kind of know what to look for and hopefully it's very simple to to um to spot uh what's this sensations fred taylor very cool I like these uh names and it's cool these cards are not sticking together there's a tim couch rookie are not sticking together like i was afraid of uh james jet he was fun to watch um so yeah usually these older cards are going to stick together these are not uh, maybe it's this protective layer here this is terrell davis second oh no okay so he's been playing for a little while 95 oh okay so this looks refractor-ish right gadsen then we have the tim couch rookie worthless oh there it goes okay so it says refractor right on top that makes it easier so let's just run through this real quick um see if any of these say refract that's an insert let's see if any of them say refract oops refractor on the top i guess troy aikman i should probably put this aside he's a hall of famer i believe making a mess over here these are the cards that i like um none of them say refractor all right let's keep moving they're pretty easy to open to the packs they don't stick or anything like that <laughs> ebenezer come on uh chris chandler steve young andre bad moon rising had his house burnt down by left eye of tlc when they were dating there's a nice shannon sharp uh, John Kitna again. He, I think he came in. He was a backup uh, for the most part of his career. Uh, Ebenezer Ekuban, uh, rookie. I don't know if that's how you say his name. But uh, John Kitna would come in off, basically off the bench and then do well. I think he was a Cincinnati also. Always a good backup quarterback and just almost just just not good enough to be a starter i guess would be uh, his career nice natron means a good running back for san diego for a while and then they picked up ladanian tomlinson ah oh, marvin harrison gadson again oh that would have sucked if it was another uh refract there's an emmett smith that's a good one. Oh, this is gems okay so it's uh like a subset within the set i guess There's a heck of a lot of cards in this set. I think maybe under 200. Courtney Hawkins, Mark Brunel, Junior Seau. Okay, what's that one? I like to double check. Uh, Champ Bailey. I think this might be his rookie year. And Deion Sanders. Wow. Oh no. Is it? Is he... um... Okay, well. I think that might be his rookie card um all right uh cleland and Ch oh yeah it is his rookie so there's a champ bailey rookie right there so i'll put this in the cool pile i mean he was a good good corner for a few years uh, probably five years it's hard to be the best corner for a long time that's a tough spot i mean more for the youngins <laughs> uh nice randall cunningham john elway i'll put him down here and uh Good old Dan Marino. Carl Pickens. I remember he would go long a lot, and Jeff Blake would hit him. That was a fun little combo to watch. I wasn't a Bengals fan, but I did uh, like to watch those two guys throw. Or, you know, watch that combination. Sensations of Jake Plummer. We're roughly halfway done. I don't have a, an exact science or count going with cards. Let's just... Let's just find it easier to talk about basketball and base uh, football just because I guess less people uh, in the sport less players uh, Jimmy Smith Ricky Waters Notre Dame standout Niners then the uh, Seattle Seahawks uh, is that Mo some Muhammad uh, rookie of Rob Conrad so I keep looking because we should get two refractors total in uh, 
in here. There we go. Uh, who we got here? Johnny Morton, Adrian Morrell, uh, Keenan McCardell. All right. Played for the Browns for a little bit. He got drafted by the Browns. Um, Jake Plummer. This is Michael Westbrook. Um, it wasn't even like got punched in the face. Uh, and Eddie George Gems. Cool. That's a good one. Eddie George was good. I think concussions probably stopped his career. I remember his, he was playing against the Raiders once. I remember one game he was playing against the Raiders, and I think he got knocked out and fumbled. I mean, he fumbled because he hit right in the head and then um, lost the ball, but he got knocked clean out. Uh, I think it was like three times in a short span. I was like, damn, that's dangerous. But, you know, that was before everybody really knew about um, what's a CTE or whatever it's called. It was Chris McAllister? Yeah, Chris McAllister rookie. So I remember that was like, whoa, man. This guy, needs, this guy needs to be careful. I mean, you always pull for... I mean, I always pulled for, like, the good, solid players... And just, you know, hope they do well, but not too well to beat the team that I'm rooting for. Uh, there's Terrell Owens, Cordell Stewart, nice. Easy Ed McCaffrey, Christian's father. Yancey Thigpen, he had a few good years in, uh, I want to say Pittsburgh, right? Uh, rookie of Michael Cloud. I think we already got that one. Let's see. Oh, Chargers for Yancey Thigpen. Um, yeah, he was with Pittsburgh there. A little short story on him in the backs. These are nice cards. I really like top spine. Filthy Fred Taylor. <laughs> uh, who do we have here? Is that something? Oh, Aeneas Williams. Trent Green. I always liked Trent Green. I really liked that. I thought he was really good. Um, no, no Kurt Warner. But for some reason, I thought Kurt Warner was in this set. That's why I freaking bought it. What a waste. Uh, oh wait, that's a Fred Taylor sensation. It's not rookie. Whoa. Anyway, look for refractors here. This pack is all beat up. Jamal Anderson, the dirty bird. Um, here we go. Chris Chandler, filthy Fred Taylor again. I mean, they're, they're kind of stuck, but they're not really stuck. Curtis, my favorite Martin. That's what What's-His-Name used to say all the time. Another John Kitna. Pretty sure I can make the set of this one. There's Jamal Anderson, Mr. Dirty Bird. So they did the whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. That was, a fun, that was a fun team to watch, the Rams. Let's see, Garrison Hurst. Uh, Johnny Morton, Junior, Seau. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna build. Yeah, I'm gonna build the set for this one. Um, Ike Hilliard. Ooh, look at that. That might be a refract refractor. And Champ Bailey rookie again. Yep, refractor. So there's our two refractors. I don't expect us to get any more based on one in every 12 packs. And we get 24 packs in the box with six cards per pack. Steve Young, Boulware, Galloway, uh, Terrell, David, Terrell Davis, Gadsden, and Kate McCown, or McNown Rookie. That's pretty neat. I mean, you know, he's not like, <laughs> not gonna go in the Hall of Fame, but Josh and Cade Mc, McNown were good uh, backups. Not, you know, not the best, but yeah, still. One of them, I think Josh Mc, McNown lasted quite a while in the uh, NFL. I mean, he wasn't constant, but, uh, you know, whenever they, somebody needed a quarterback, he was ready to go. There's another Tim Couch rookie card. He was a number one, yeah, number one overall draft pick. And, you know, if he was drafted by anybody else, he would have been good. But the curse of the Browns, <laughs> no matter who you draft. <laughs> Sorry, Browns fans, but you get it. It's drafted so many, had so many decent quarterbacks come in and out of there at that time. And even now, I think, I think there was um, 
before Baker, I thought the Browns picked up a, a, a first round quarterback that didn't make it. I can't remember though. Who's this? Troy Aikman and Joe Germain? I never heard of Joe Germain. It's a refractor, but I never heard of Joe Germain. Huh. Interesting. I forgot to look for refractors, I think. There's an Isaac Bruce and another Jake Plummer. Um, all right. Well, we got uh, five, including this. It looks like five packs. Oops. Messed, messed that up. All right. There's an Adrian Morrell, Terrell Owens, Ricky Walters, OJ McDuffie. Russell Westbrook, and Rob Conrad. You know what? I'm going to build this set. I don't know. Should I record that, me building the set? I don't know. Jabs did a video where he was building a set. I want to say 2021. 20, God, stupid plastic was stuck in my finger. 2021 um, baseball, I think. I didn't watch the video, but I don't know. Some people might like that. I like building the sets. It's fun. That's what I do after, whenever I open a box, that's what I do immediately after, is uh, I try to put them in number order, and then uh, and then just have a set. But I'm all out of boxes, so I don't even know where I could put it. Abaniza. Um, let's see here, Randall. Hey, we didn't get a Dante Culpepper yet, did we? Let's see. Yeah, I don't think we did. Um, Shannon Sharp, Marvin Harrison, and Herman Moore. Uh, two box. I'm not going to open both boxes because I'm kind of, kind of upset at myself for not doing my research. I thought there was a Kurt Warner rookie in this box. I believe I am wrong. Let's see here. Terrence Mathis. Freddie Jones, Mark Brunel, and Carl Pickens, and Muhammad, and Emmett Gems. Not a refractor. All right, quick check. All right, last pack. Let's see what we're working with here. That one. It's gonna open a weird way. All right, so our rookie is gonna be Chris McAllister again. No relation to Kevin McAllister. Ed McCaffrey, Cordell, uh, Robert Brooks, and there's that McAllister rookie. All right, well, quick check. All right, so nothing good. Um, this is overpriced for sure. I paid way too much for these boxes. I mean, you get some big names, you get that rookie, but uh, not great, not great. Um, all right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. I, you know what? I'm probably going to do... I'm probably going to build the set right now. Um, I'll record it. You know, if anybody likes it, you like it. Um, I don't know how you dislike it, because if you're going to sit and watch somebody build a set, that's on you. All right. Thank you guys for watching this video, and I will see you next time. <laughs>